So this is the duck toy, and this is another very simple machine. It's got only two parts. There's this, the main body of the duck with its front leg is all one rigid body, and then there's a pivoted leg, and this is not spring-loaded or anything like that. It just is completely passive. So, um, you know, one thing that's kind of interesting is if you can see the center of gravity of the duck body is almost directly above the pivot point for that back leg. But when you put the, the duck on his ramp, he sort of assumes a tilting position and the center of gravity goes just in front of that leg to the point where he will start actually falling downhill and walking. So as the duck walks, you can see a couple of you know, really interesting motions, and when you look at it in uh, high speed, you'll really be able to appreciate it. But for instance, you know, as he moves, the there's an impact that goes on between each between each foot and the ground. There's an impact that goes on between the feet as they clap together like this, and then there's another really interesting impact that happens as the duck body actually impacts the foot with a stopper that's internal to its body there. In super slow motion, you can clearly see all of the physics in action. Notice how the rear foot skids forward when it impacts its mechanical stop with the duck. I call this the duck moonwalk. Here's a close-up in super slow motion. 